Texas Representative Terry Canales would like to see people who commit more serious cr crimes behind bars and not those who use or possess small amounts of marijuana. Our Mike Jimenez explains. Let's, let's lock up people we're scared of, not that we're mad at. Uh, and so, at the end of the day, uh, I'm, I'm not really scared of somebody who's got a marijuana cigarette. Texas Representative Terry Canales says when the legislature convenes on January 8th, one of the items he would like to focus on would be criminal justice reform. Our jails are overcrowded. Uh, we're jailing people for things that people shouldn't be jailed for, or we need to reform and relook at the way we do things. Canales says decriminalizing marijuana could be a solution to jail overcrowding. It's an issue facing Hidalgo County to the tune of $3.8 million last year, which the county spent to house inmates at other facilities. Canales says he favors a site and release program. And it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt your pocketbook. But ostensibly what we're doing when we take somebody to jail, the taxpayer's paying for it. We're paying to lock up somebody for a marijuana cigarette all day long. Canales adds there are also issues within the court system that also must be addressed. If you happen to be on probation and you violate your probation for a technical offense, uh, you're held without bond until your court date. Some of those things, uh, mechanisms that are in place, overcrowd our jails. In McAllen, I'm Mike Jimenez reporting. And Canales adds he would rather see real criminals in our jails and not someone walking around with a marijuana cigarette.